right guys, welcome back to the channel. Uh, so here's just an update video, what's going on with the Camaro. So I was hoping to have part two set up. So this weekend I would have put part two out and then during the week I would have had the car back together and would have been finished by next weekend. But I got everything stripped down, I filmed everything, and then I went, I hit it with self-etching primer. Then I went and used the SEM high build primer and I'm having major adhesion issues in um, a lot of parts of the bay. You can see over here, the paint is cracked. I didn't even want to adhere. For the most part, this side's all right. The core support was all right. This was all bare metal, this stuff no problem. Uh, this was mostly bare metal. This looks like it stuck no problem. The frame rails are all right. It's really just this side of the wheel arch area and then random spots in the firewall. So I think what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna pick up some uh, aircraft stripper. I'm gonna <clears throat> strip down the firewall, strip down maybe both wheel arch. Yeah, there's a little over here too. There's just random like little spots and I sanded everything, I degreased everything, you know, I wiped everything down. So I don't know if it's just like because the surface was dirty or there was oil, but I mean to me, like especially back here, it looks like it just had a reaction with the existing paint that was underneath because it's all like cracking, almost like it uh it was reacting with the paint and it just wouldn't stick, it was melting the paint underneath. You can see over here where I was able to just like smush it off where it didn't adhere. The same thing over here. So yeah, it sucks, but uh, hopefully it only delay me one weekend. I should have color on by next weekend and part two should be out by next weekend. Uh, during the week, I'm gonna pick up the aircraft stripper, strip everything down. Um, I picked up more sanding disc. I'm gonna get everything sanded down. Uh, to avoid this happening again, I'm just gonna use a different primer altogether because this was like a rattle can primer. Um, this time I'm gonna use 2K high build primer. I'm gonna shoot it out of a gun. Uh, this is the same primer I used when I had the car painted and I uh, block sanded the whole car. So this stuff sprays really good. It's thick. I didn't have any adhesion problems at all with it. I just got to pick up another quarter hardener. I got maybe a third of a can left in here, so that should be fine. And then I have a quart of base coat, which is the color of the car. So that's what I'm going to actually use for my uh, base coat. And then to actually clear it, because I didn't want to use regular automotive clear coat because last time I did that, uh, that's when everything was cracking. I guess from the heat, I had to get a different type of clear coat. I'm not sure. So I'm just going to spray it with uh, high heat engine paint. So I'll just put that over as my clear. I'm going to do underneath the hood too. I got all that cleaned up and ready to go. Keep an eye out for uh, part two. I hope to have it out by the weekend.